opportunities in the pass game. Play action, they flip it across the middle, catch made, blow delivered, and still running is Gus Penning. The tight end with a huge play down to the 30. And he came right out of the backfield, right here. He's, he looks like he's gonna lead block and then actually just sneaks behind the linebacker, Alexander. The ball had to be thrown in a hurry because of the safety that Ahmad Thomas coming in so quickly, and that's exactly what he does. He reads it, feels it, gets the ball thrown in a hurry. It was only physical Penning's tackle there. Pretty good wheels after the yeah, catch, didn't yeah. he? Well, yeah, well, a lot of space, but ran over Ahmad Thomas and then did show some some speed. 39-yard gain sets him up on first down. Set him with a punt fake. The end zone. Jay Lee is wide open and dropped it. And it was very easy for Lee to get around him. He just dropped the ball. Linwood runs forward. Linwood chased down by Stryker for a loss. Now need eight yards after the loss. Stidham on a slant. Cannon makes a catch inside the five. First and goal clutch for Katie Cannon. And the quarterback. The middle of the field is wide open. Watch the ball, and the, there's the arm strength that we've talked all week about from Jarrett Stidham. And look at the arm strength. That ball is thrown, as we say, on a rope there between the safeties. Behind the linebackers, this is where they like to attack. They get their speed out in space. They love to come into the middle behind those linebackers. Here's his arm strength. It's that tight spiral we've seen from him. It's Charles Tapper, who's down for the Sooners. Chafin already with three touchdowns. They fake it to him. Throw to the big fella. 410 pound touchdown. Twinkle in his eyes and come on, you get involved with the big belly, so you might see something. <laughs> That's what I thought. If there's, <laughs> if there's ever a time.